What's up guys, Big Ben here and we got some NBA 2K13 and this is a series I really wanted to do but by the time I got my recording equipment you know I was already into like my third season with my guy so I didn't know if it was maybe too late to do it you know or start a new one but you know what I decided what the hell I wanted to do it so guess what I'm gonna do it so here we go we got Big Ben here in the rookie showcase and we already got an assist there we're gonna try to get as much as we can I want to get as drafted as high as possible because with my other guy ended up getting drafted by the Raptors and I'd love to go higher than that I think that was the eighth draft and I just I would really like to get a higher draft than eight I mean I don't expect to get a first a number one draft pick you know because another thing in this game I was struggling because I'm so used to playing with my other guy everything falls you know I can take you know fadeaways and all these other shots and it just they go in you know he's he's a 99 overall so when I'm starting fresh it was really really different because you'll see later I, I just start missing some of the easiest shots I'm like what in the hell is going on but it's just you know this guy's not built up and that's something that took me a minute to get used to. So what we're going to try to do here is we're going to try to get as many assists, as many rebounds, some steals, you know. And and I definitely want to get some, I wanted to get some steals, maybe a block. But there's a board right there. We got a couple boards now, I think. One or two. Well, we got two boards already. Some assists. So we're looking all right right now. It's, the, you know, the first quarter. And look at there. Boom! There's Big Ben's first points. And look, it's late. Late in the first quarter before I get my first points but honestly I think if I'm not mistaken that was my first shot I'm pretty sure because I was trying to you know to make sure I get assists make sure I get rebounds you know that's what I was worried about more than anything else you know because I felt like I needed to get at least a double double I wanted a triple double but you know we'll see what happens but anyway here we go we're in the rookie showcase and like i said i'm just gonna i clip this out and i'm gonna show you the best parts i'm not gonna show you oh look at that steal right there baby give me that that is mine take off give me some point give me an assist baby no fuck but anyways we get it, the team grade grows up on goes up on that because you know it was a steal or whatever so that'll work but let's see if we can make some moves here big bingo ankle breaker boom oh my god he missed the dunk are you serious oh man but we're gonna get this thing going i hope y'all like this series and look at that they just let me run right on in there do a little layup and we got some points man we got some points we gotta get some points because i really want to get drafted higher than eight which is what i got drafted with my other guy like i was telling you and there's a dumb foul right there a dumb foul i hate getting dumb fouls and i'm so used to you know my other guy like i said i can steal shit you know, if you dribble in the ball, the other big man, you know, he's going to steal it. But this is different. We're starting over. I got to remember that. So let's get it going here. Let's get some assists right there, baby. That's right. Man, and just keep feeding Anthony Davis, man. Oh, my God. Look here. Sorry, I had to get a little swallow of water there. Let's get a board there, baby. Get as many rebounds as we can. Oh, look at that. Let's see what we got going on here. I know we got to get some points. Look at this, man. I only got four points. Oh, there's another assessor. Look at that bounce. Oh, my God. And he missed a dunk. Man, y'all are killing me. I'm missing dunks. They missing dunks. Get out of here. Steal that shit. That's mine. There we go. So we got another seal. That's two steals. We got some boards. We got some assists. Oh, man. I don't know what that was about. It's, oh, watch this. Watch this. Run him down. Get out of here. Get out of here. Well, we got to get a little series going here. I hope y'all enjoy this. I love playing this game. I play it every chance I get, you know, and I don't have other stuff going on. Let's see if we can get a board here, baby. Nope. Damn it. There it is. There we go. There's a rebound. I knew I put this highlight in there for something. And throw it on down and get me some. Oh, no, man. You're not going to get me an assist. All right. What are we going to do? Let's do a little pick and roll here. And look at that. Boom. Dunk. That's right. There's another assist, guys. There's another assist. But I love this game. I enjoy playing it. And like I said, I didn't get my recording equipment till way after the game came out. So I was 
Oh, look at that. Oh, balls in your face. Watch this. Who you guarding, man? Balls in your face. Get the hell out of here. But that seems to be the only thing we can score. Look at that draft stock rising, baby. Halftime is here. Draft stock is rising. It looks like we need to work on team play is the biggest thing. And scoring, of course. I have no points. I've got six points in the first half. But there's another assist right there, baby. That's right. Anthony Davis, man. Just feed him the ball. Feed it to him. Look at this. Look at that pass. Boom. Assist again. I was drumming that time. <clears throat> Excuse me. But guys, this this series here, this takes a lot of work to make these videos. So there, there might not be a lot. It might not be an everyday thing, you know, that I make these videos. But I'm going to try to get as many of them as I can. And plus, you know, I got the baseball. I got you know hockey I've got all these other things going but this is something like I said I really 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 wanted to do um I wish I would have got my recording equipment all a little earlier so that we could have got this series started when the game first came out but I didn't get to so we'll take what we got and uh I know it's late like I, said, I know this series is getting started extremely late but what can I do, you know? I wasn't even going to do it, but I changed my mind because I really wanted to. So, let's see what we got going Oh, and I hate this play right here. This pissed me off. Look at that. Oh, my God. A bad pass. That is not good. And here I come. Out of the game. Make a bad pass. You're out of the game. Jesus Christ, man. I don't need that. That is not something I need to be doing. Making bad passes. Making, you know, turnovers is not something I need to do in this game. Because if you start doing bad shit, it's going to screw you up. Look at that. Oh, I thought I had that rebound. I guess not. But anyway, here we go. Let's work the ball down. we got to get some points. We still only have six points. Six points is all we've got. And I'm trying to work in there. I'm trying to get in. Can't get it. Let's do a little jumper. And no, a miss. Oh, my God missing shots man i can't be doing that it's killing me i can't score can't get no points trying to keep this guy out and look at there there we go all right let's work the ball on now see i mean we're, we're doing good look we, ha we have plenty of assists we have plenty of rebounds but no points no points at all it's killing me man six points is not going to cut it here we go in your face oh my god again who are you kind of step up on man get the hell out of here see it looks like the only points i can get is from dunks i'm missing little old stupid ass shots i'm missing the easiest shots man it don't make no sense but oh well uh, where you think you're going get the hell out of here with that shit block that baby so now we got a block throw a little block in there and they take us out Oh my god, so we got a block and they take us out. Dunk on one end, block on the other, and they take us out. Jesus. Look at that little fadeaway baby. There we go. Now we hitting some shots. We up to 10, 10 points, and it's in the fourth quarter. So we really got to get hot because I'm starting to stress a little here. I'm like, oh my god, I'm not getting nothing. And let's get another board there. There we go. Now I get on the fast break. No, let's slow it down. <laughs> I thought we were gonna fast break there. Look at that, another assist. All right, so we're getting we're getting somewhere. We're getting some assists. We got ten points. I know that's nowhere near as many as I wanted to have because the first time that I played when I got drafted by Toronto, um, I had I think twenty five points. So and that kind of screwed me right there because the clock ran out. They get they almost turned it over. But I'm gonna chase him down. Get out of here. Block that shit, baby. That's right. Oh, my God. But we got to get some points. I'm starting to stress. I'm starting to stress a little bit. We only got 10 points, 9 assists, 6 boards. So I'm trying to make something happen here. And look at there. There we go. All right. We got 12 now. We got 12. So we got to get things going, man. We're running out of time. Two minutes left. And I've only got 12 points. So I'm trying to leak out. I start trying to leak out of here, and there's the double-double right there. Look at that alley-oop. Oh, my God. So we got a double-double. But I don't have the points that I need. I only have 12. So I do start leaking out a little. Look at me. Take, I'm going to take off right here. All right, y'all get that board. I'm going. Pass it to me. I got to get some points, man. 
seven seconds left and a layup so we got 14 points we're up to the a minus so i'm happy with that we should have had more but i started making some bad shots trying to score in the late in the fourth quarter and it dropped us a little bit but we got an a minus 14 points points six boards 10 assists our shooting percentage i think was what 33 percent which is not good 32 33 something like that which is not good at all well we're gonna get right in here to some uh to some pre-draft interviews and i'm gonna let this take over like i said i did not perform the way i wanted to but i'm not gonna just restart and do it over and over and over and over what i got is what i got so there we go big ben's headed to the locker room let's see who we got to talk to guys Good game out there tonight, son. I'm the GM of the Raptors, and I must say, I was impressed with your performance. We have the eighth pick of the draft and are looking for someone to be the face of our franchise. We'd like to ask you a couple questions and get a feel of how well you'd fit in with us. I really think the first piece to getting this franchise back on track is to find and develop our point guard of the future. We have Jose Calderon on the roster, but we've been thinking lately that we might need to go in another direction here. We think you might be that new direction. What do you think? I know you're going to talk to some of the other point guards in the draft, but none of them are going to have my work ethic, my character, my dedication, and my sheer will to win basketball games. I'm eager to be the face of a franchise, and I don't want to do it anywhere else but in Toronto. Interesting. Next question. We feel like we have a great young core in Bargnani and now Valenciunas coming over from Europe. We might not turn things around immediately, but if we can add another great young talent, we'll be a team to contend with in a short time. Are you willing to be part of a developing process for a few seasons, even if that means losing your fair share of games? Yeah, I see this as a great opportunity. Everyone expects the Raptors to be young and inexperienced, and that is exactly why we would take the lead by storm. If I came aboard, there'd be just too much talent for teams to deal with. I really think I could turn this franchise around, man. Okay, that's all I have. I love what I heard here. We would love to have you join us. We'll be in touch. Good game out there, Good game out there tonight, son. I'm the GM of the Kings, and I must say, I was impressed with your performance. We have the fifth pick in this draft, and we're looking at potentially using this pick on you. First, though, we'd like to get to know you better by asking you a couple questions. Let's get to it. We realize that here in Sacramento, we don't have the appeal of a Los Angeles or a New York or Chicago. We tend to look for players who would be proud to be part of this organization. Someone who can really take pride in being a member of the Sacramento Kings. Someone who's willing to spend their entire career as a member of the Kings. Are you that person? Yeah, I would be honored to be a member of this organization. From everything I've seen, you guys have a rabid fan base out in Sacktown. I'd love to be a leader on this team for the next decade. Next question. Being in the NBA brings a lot of responsibilities, and some people just aren't ready for it, if you know what I mean. What are your plans once you get that first paycheck? Easy answer. My parents have spent their entire life putting me into the position I'm in right now. I want nothing more than to take care of them and make sure that the rest of their lives are as carefree as possible. I don't need glitz and glamour. I just need my loved ones cared for. Okay, I think I've heard all I needed to hear for now. You're definitely someone we can use on our team. Now we just need you to be available when it's our turn to pick. Greetings, I'm the GM and Director of Player Personnel for the Detroit Pistons. We're picking ninth in the upcoming draft. We love what we saw in you and want to ask you some questions to see how well you'd fit in with us. Question number one. The team that we built here in Detroit was a rebuilding effort that didn't quite pan out. Obviously, it's difficult to predict the future, but I expect to see a fair amount of roster turnover as we work towards retooling the lineup for another rebuilding effort. How comfortable would you feel coming into a situation where the roster is in a state of flux? Oh, that's not a problem for me at all. To me, that just says the people running the team want nothing less than titles. Plural. Titles. It'd be an honor for me to play for a team like that. I want to win, man. Badly. Okay, last question. How important is it for you to be a lottery pick in the draft? Honestly, I don't really care. 
I'm more concerned with going to the right team than I am going as high as possible. I want to play for someone who's going to utilize me to the best of my abilities. Someone who's going to use me to put the team into a position to win games. You heard? Thanks so much for your time. I don't want to get ahead of myself here, but we would be ecstatic if you're still on board when it's our turn to pick. All right, guys, so here we go. It's NBA draft time, baby, and we can go as high as fifth. We can go as high as fifth. Now, honestly, I'd love to go to Detroit. I mean, I was just at the Palace a couple weeks ago watching the Hawks and the Pistons, but, you know, I'd love to play in the Palace with Detroit, but the mock draft says we're going to Toronto, so let's see what we got going on here. Good evening, and welcome to the 2012 NBA draft. Tonight represents the culmination of years of hard work for 60 of the world's best young players. It is also a time of optimism for our fans and our teams. It's going to be a great night. I know the young men hoping to hear their names called tonight can't wait to compete against the best basketball players in the world. So let's get started. With the ninth pick in the 2012 NBA Draft, the Detroit Pistons select the 19-year-old point guard from University of Georgia. So we're headed to the Palace, guys. We're headed to Detroit. And uh, we're going to see what we can get going in Detroit here. And uh, we'll be back for more as soon as I can get some games going. I have played one game. So here's the contract negotiations. And obviously, it's just the basic contract. Hope you all enjoyed it. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Later.